Hello, welcome to The Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I continue with my Let's Play of Chroma Squad. We are on episode 13, folks. And it is time to, well, spend some of the cash money we have after we check our stuff. Sup, Gaga here. Hey, how you all, how, hey you all, how you doing? There we go. Just checking to see if everything is fine. I want your show to be as, to be huge as much as you do. Let's make your audience go through the roof. Alright, fine. And the biggest Jet fan. Just wanted to tell you that I'm in love. Jet is the reason why I love your series so much, and I tell all my friends about it. I wish Jet would treat the rest of the squad a little better, but they're kind of okay. Bye-bye. All right, well, there's no responses I can toss out at the folks. So be with it. We're going to go check out the studio upgrades. And it looks like we still can't get a bigger studio, unfortunately, but that's okay. We... That's an investment in the future right there, guys. We're going to do it. We're also going to upgrade this. We definitely needed that. Upgrade our lamps as well. Fresnels. What is that? I don't even know what that means, but okay. Additionally, it looks like the health care can go up as well. And the camera work can go up. Ooh, yeah, we'll definitely do that one. Ooh, the workbench can go up now as well. Cool. And I guess that's it. So healthcare and uh, the workbench are the next two that we can upgrade, but we won't do that yet. Alright, that's fine. Let's see what else. Crafting, let's check that out. Okay, it looks like there are some better items available to us. Do you want to go fast? Plus two movement, plus three acrobatics range from the catapult, okay. Health and counter with one random property. So, yeah. The custom hero helmet, okay. You can win any cosplay contest. I don't hate that. We can craft that actually, huh, that's interesting. Alright, and what is this? The pointer. Targeting assistance for your giant robot. Huh, interesting. Huh, maybe. Oh, is this a, a disjointed axe? Well, I think I might wait on that one. Let's go actually take a look at the shop. Alright, we have a change sword. I'm sure the sparks are holographic. Maybe. Alright, and the heavy axe. Yeah, I think I want that one. Let's see, it's gonna be you who can equip it. Oh yeah, our health will go down a little tiny bit, but everything else goes through the roof. We're definitely getting this. Buy and equip. Yep, it's done. A designer rifle, a, lo a looky spear. Looky spear! Used in the last Revengers movie. Okay. We have the Star Bow of Death. I'd rather not get that. And what do we have for equipment here? A fast hero helmet. Okay. 35 health. Uh, 70. Ooh, a strong hero helmet. Hmm. Oh, well, we could do this. Let's see here. Uh, let's go with you. We'll buy and equip with you. And then that's it for now. We're going to go back to crafting. I apologize, folks. Let's... Let's not do crafting yet. Let's go play with our mecha. That's right. We're going to go play with our mecha, guys. It's fine. We're going to get these right here. The armored legs of oblivion. And I like it. I like it a lot. We're going to get plus 50 health right now, which is going to be sweet, sweet, nice style. And we could get more power with our sword attack, but I think we will, actually. That's going to be the play. We're going to get that. But not quite yet. All right, now we can go into crafting. I think I would like this hat, if at all possible. Let's check it out. It looks like dodge and attack. So, her counter goes down, but her dodge goes up. What about you? Same thing. Um, yeah, we'll go with you. We'll equip it with you. There we go. I don't hate that. Let's see what else. Colored boots. Eh. 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 And we have no... Okay. Well, that's fine. All right, we're going to roll with this, and we're going to start up our first season, our season premiere here, and hopefully everything pans out. I also think we need to make a, take a peek over here at our skills. 
The 5th Gen Phoenix instantly revives a fallen ally up to three tiles away with 50% HP. Nice. Alright, that is on Flashy. Okay, the Techie, he's got three choices. Uh, gain plus 20 audience from using skills, okay. All enemies up to four tiles away get a minus three move and minus 50% attack. Rounded down by two turns, or four two turns. And you deal 30% damage with pistols and rifles. I think we're going to go with the audience thing. I like it. We're going to take a look at the lead now. Pull an enemy up to... Okay, all standing allies move to your side. Join up, okay. Provoke all enemies up to seven tiles away will ignore your allies for three turns. And heal 30% of your health. Huh. That's interesting. I think I'd rather have the join up skill. That does sound a bit better. Alright, let's see here. Gain double audience for dealing damage. Ooh. Uh, plus 15% base attack. That's not bad. And your weapon attacks deal 50% more damage. I don't think we need that. So we're going to go with fan club. And let's see here. You deal plus 50% critical damage and gain 15% chance to stun with daggers. Or make a lightning attack at melee range. I think we're going to go with that, but I don't have a dagger. Well, oh, whatever. We're going to do it. It's fine. We don't actually have daggers right now. She's kind of using like a sword or something. I'm just saying. She's got an oversized sword at that and an enlarged sword. So, it is simply what it is. Alright, so all that being said and done, it's recording time, guys. Friend Gaga and his portal. With the help of the Bump Starts Here Incorporated's new friend Gaga, the third season begins with a huge boost in audience and a bigger budget to match. Whoa. Hmm. Director's Instructions, Part 1 of 3. Perform three team acrobatics, defeat four enemies with the lead. Alright, we can totally do that, I think. Even though he does hit like a sissy girl, I think we'll still be able to do it. Alright, let's give it a shot. It's going to be a three-part episode, too. Having a bigger budget is so exciting. Now that we can afford it, why don't we do that episode I wrote months ago? I would love to... That junk about zombies and time travel? No way. The only reason we have a bigger budget now is because of my leadership and Gaga's tips. We are mainstream now. We need to think bigger now. That Gaga guy is helping us a lot, but Jet, you are not alone. We are a team. We'll talk about this later, but right now, as our leader, I say we should start the season with Gaga's idea. The monster portal story? Uh, we've recorded a portal episode already. It'll be fine. Narrator, do the talking, please. Our heroes are still searching for the interdimensional portal. A portal they believe to be the source of all monsters invading Earth. Gaga told us that he set up the portal at the forest. Did you buy new narrator software, Jet? Some people grew fond of the old one. Bad grammar and all. We can't have subpar narration anymore, Flashy. Off to the forest. Alright. So, onward we go. Ooh, shiny. A few moments later, the bump starts here incorporated and their camera crew started recording the episode. That's weird that they would say that. Something tells me that a threat is near. It's best for us to stay alert. Oh no! Actually, they look a little bit tougher, don't they? The threat was near than you expected, huh? You're never wrong, Dana, but watch out, there are more. Who knows? Hey, little frog dude. Perform three team acrobatics and defeat four enemies with the lead, or with the lead, either one. Alright, they have a hundred health, a well-made nutcracker. Alright, fair enough. Alright, we'll come over here and we will use teamwork. And or that didn't really work, did it? Okay. Huh. I feel like perhaps we aren't doing something 100% right. Alright, we'll come over here. We'll use teamwork once again. Come on down here. Team Acrobatics number one. And we will do teamwork. And we will do team acrobatics number two. 
And it is done, and now... Going for the kill. Alright. We defeated one with the lead. Let's hope we survive the fallout here. Ouch. The frogman is coming. Oh no! Dynamite! That actually hurt a little bit. Ooh, the lead just got beat down a little. It's okay, we're hanging in there. Ouch. Alright. Lights! Camera! Chromatize! Alright. It's chroma time! Chroma Tyson time? I don't... It's fine. Alright. Next up, we are going to use teamwork here. And we're going to come over here and bash this guy's head in. With a little bit of love. And hate. Alright, that's sweet, sweet, nice style. Alright, it looks like we should be able to... Leap over there. And then turn on this guy and nerf, please. Down you go. Next up, we need to defeat a couple more enemies with the lead. That's totally fine with me. I'm going to move right in here, and we're going to use multi-shot. And that was actually pretty darn cool. Okay, let's see. What are we going to do now? Uh, how much damage does this thing do? Shouldn't be enough to kill him off, so we're going to hope that it's not, and we're going to fire on him. Oh, it barely did anything to him. All right. The frogman cometh. Ow, we got shot again. Oh, we got stunned. Get handled. All right. Well, that being said, we will use a teamwork. We will use a little bit more teamwork. And we could probably even use more teamwork if we really wanted to, but I don't think we need to. So instead, we're going to do this. All right, here we goes. Bam! All right, we've taken three out of the four of them out. That we need to with our lead. Circle of friendship, heal all! There it is. Now it's just the frogman and the shooter, shooter, pew, pew guy. And that is fine. All right, we're going to go and handle the frog right now. All right, we're going to do teamwork. We're going to use our healer to come over here and teamwork as well. And we're going to use our leader to come and get the kill. And I suppose if we had to, we can come down here. We can teamwork and... Oh, we actually can't make it. Okay. A grenade! Alright, we're going to come over here. We're going to use our stunning pose. Bam. All right, and then we're going to use our lightning dagger. Very cool. And then we get to finish it off. Nice. All right, we defeated the enemies, and we did everything that we were supposed to, so the, di the director should be super happy with us. Right after dealing with all the minions. Wow, these new minions look great, and I love the set as well. Well, I have to admit that it's a big improvement. Oh, no! Silly mortals, did you? <laughs> did you think you would reach the monster portal? That's why we've come here. Where is this portal? I'll never tell you. This information is above your access level. Access level? Cut it out. We have an episode to record. Hmm, so you are Gaga's Franz. I see. All the props are already here. We just need some footage from this place. And later on, to the portal thing. You will have to best me first. Oh no, more minions! Alright, I can totally dig this. Let's do it. Uh-oh. We came from the portal to fight by your side, malevolent, male malevolent plant. Okay. Uh, should I say something now? This is very different from the script. Keep all of your heroes standing. Defeat the boss monster with the lead. Okay, so we have quite a few things that we can do right now. And first and foremost, I'm going to do this stunning pose. Which is, of course, sweet, sweet, nice style. We're going to do that. And then we're going to take this guy out. Bam! Get handled. Look at our pink squatty doing work. 
All right, we're gonna go over here and we're gonna use teamwork once again. And we're gonna jump up over here, which hopefully did some good work. Square house kick. Drop these two fools. Ooh, he survived. That's uh, a little interesting. All right, gonna hop over here and I, yeah, we'll do this. Why not? Multi shot. Yeah, gadget geek. What? All right, we can come on over here and we're gonna smush this guy if at all possible. Nope, no such luck. All right, so she's a little exposed and out and on her own, but that's okay. We should be okay. The healer is coming over, but unfortunately, he won't actually be able to throw the heals. Ouch, unpleasant. Very unpleasant. Oh, get countered and run away. Oh! Okay, that happened. Ow. Definitely gonna have to throw a heal duking out after that. Ouch. Alright, heal Dukin, go! Alright, let's see, what do we have? What is our play here? Okay, that worked out. We can easily-ish drop that guy. And our final move, I guess, would be to come over here and... Pew Pew this guy? I don't think it's gonna be enough to drop him, but maybe. Nope, not quite. Alright, he's going to come back over and try to be defensive? I don't know. Ow. It's like we're going to have to use our circle of friendship here in a moment. Alright, easy kill. Alright, unfortunately we can do nothing with you yet. I'm going to come over here we're going to use teamwork with our leader, which is totally against his belief system, I'm just saying. I'm going to hop on over and we're going to do some damage to this guy. And get handled with a giant axe. What? All right. And additionally, I suppose we can come on over and punch and kick and do all the weird, crazy things that we just did. I will never give up. I will never surrender. All right, we too will hop on over and we will throw out our circle of friendship. Okay. Next up, it looks like a, a bomb, a bomb is coming. Ooh, we dodged, and now we're gonna get hit by this. A bit unpleasant, to be sure. Alright, we're gonna go for teamwork here. There's literally no way you can do anything. Get you to come over here. Yeah, really. Alright, well, I'm going to fire on you. Can our lead make it all the way over there? Oh, he can, totally. That's awesome. Join up. Alright. Gonna try for the kill on this guy. Oh, we did a lot of damage, but not enough to drop him, unfortunately. And we can't see his health, which is kind of annoying, but we'll figure it out. Alright, soon and very soon we will have the victory we're looking for. Ow! All right, what are we going for here? All right, we can come over here. We can finish this guy off. That's sweet, sweet, nice style. Um, well, it looks like we can do anything from there, unfortunately. All right, gonna come over here. We're gonna use that. We're also gonna come over here and use this. And we're going to have our lead try to finish this off and see what happens. Not enough. Wow. Alright, will we survive? Looks like we will. Alright, we'll do teamwork. Some teamwork there. You can definitely close with it. How much health does he have left? 207. We shouldn't be able to kill it from here. Double attack, 187. And here's the finishing blow from our lead. And all of our heroes stay, stayed standing, or stay stooding, or stood standing, stayed, I don't know, it's fine. Alright, we did it. We completed the director's instructions, but who oh knows? Weaklings, you will never find the monster portal. <laughs> it's fine. It's totally fine. 
Tree Bien. Uh, now I'm leafing. Okay, is it like Tree Bien? Sure. I see more minions incoming. Quickly regroup before we're overrun. And it looks like we will continue on with this crazy chaotic fighting. We'll need to deal with them, otherwise we'll just, or we'll need to jump and swim. Okay, that's weird. Would you really jump in the water and swim away? Bunch of cowards. No, running is never an option for us. The city's safety comes first. Well, we're kind of getting a little overrun here. The script, why are you getting all the cool lines, Jet? And the director's instructions are all about you, too. The lead should be on the best takes. It's how Sentai works. Jet is right, everyone. Lead-centric is a tradition. Please, everyone, don't argue. Let's just try and have fun like we usually do. Let's see what you are capable of, Chroma Squad. All right. Keep the lead standing. Defeat all eight enemies, or defeat eight enemies. Okay. So let's see. What is the play here? Well, I think the first play is to annihilate you. Lightning dagger. Sweet, sweet, nice. Drop you. Oh, not quite enough. That's a bit surprising, actually. All right, we're going to go down here, and we're going to use our square house kick. And, oh man, another one survived. What is going on? Hmm. Well, we'll go over here and we'll take it out with our lead. Additionally, let's see, how far can we make it? How about we go over here? Can we shoot that far? Oh, we can. Get shot. Boom, down he goes. All right, sweet. Additionally, we'll come over here and we will shoot with our bow and arrow of death and power. Almost killed the healer frog guy. All right, so the one healer frog's gonna run over the other healer frog and then they're gonna stand there and be like, hey, we're healer frogs together, it's fine. All right, and they're just kind of looking at one another. It's creepy. Oh, there's more people sneaking onto the set. This is getting a little bit scary. Just saying. All right, we're going to utilize that. We're going to skip your turn. Over here, we're going to utilize this. And now we're going to handle you. I'm sorry. Oh, he survived. What? All right. Well, I guess we'll come over here and we'll fire on two people. Oh my gosh, he survived that too. Ooh, that's not good. Alright, we're gonna go for the kill on the frog that's injured. And we'll see what the next play is from the enemy. How many have we defeated so far? That's probably like five? Maybe six? Look at that guy in the bushes. Alright. Well, they're all moving. Only two people can really attack us from here. Ooh, that was a big heal. Good, good thing I went on the... Ooh. Our healer just kind of got wrecked. That's not good. All right, well, we gotta survive for eight turns too. Hmm. That could be interesting. All right, take that guy out. That's totally fine. And I don't know, maybe come over here and have them group up. Join up! Oh, the stun people didn't. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. Oh, we didn't kill him either. That's a bit off-putting. Alright, so we're, we're still standing. We're okay for now. Hopefully they're not stunned after this next little bit. Oh, he might actually die. Hmm. Or go down at least. Nope. They decided not to take him out. That's a bit odd to be sure. Alright, we'll fall back and we'll, we'll heal with the power of friendship. Circle of friendship, go! I know, guys, it's the most awesome skill ever. Alright, um, hmm. We're still gonna have to survive for five more turns. I don't know how that's gonna play. Hmm. Alright. Yeah, we should be able to drop that guy, and we did. Excellent. We defeated eight enemies. We just have to keep the lead standing at this point. Which is possible. All right, we'll hop on down here and we'll double team that guy and down he goes. Oh, and more people are coming, more enemies. 
Oh, we countered nice. Will we dodge anything is a question. Oh, we didn't get stunned. That's a good sign. Alright, four turns remaining. I can I can get behind this. Alright, let's see here. We'll use teamwork. Anybody else have a melee weapon? No. We'll use teamwork again. We'll come here and we'll give it a shot with these two. Oh, and it was enough. Nice! Well played, well played. Is there another giant turtle guy? No, there is not. Sweet. So that should put us in a slightly more advantageous position than we were at just a minute ago. I'm pretty scared still. I think we're still going to get wrecked, but we'll see. Alright, I'm going to go for the kill on you. And right now there's only four guys that can still attack, and only two of them are within range. Just a costume wound! What does that even mean? Oh, the frog is doing a little, like, sit-ups or push-ups or something. I don't know. It's creepy. Alright, let's get rid of the frog. Um, yeah, we can do it with just... Yeah, I should have probably done it a little bit differently. It's fine. Alright, we come over here. We're going to use this. And how much health do you... You're, you're, you're fully healthy. That's going to be good. Alright. I'll take you out with a double attack. And gonna come over here. And it is Flashy who is indeed the lowest, so we will heal Flashy up with the heal token. We have the 9,000 uh, audience right now. We're looking pretty good. We're looking very good, in fact. Uh oh. More are coming. How many turns do we have to uh, hold out for? I don't know. Alright, so I think I know what the next play is going to be. Let's see if I can do it correctly. Alright, so the next play is going to be as follows. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to utilize teamwork. And you can total... Okay, good. And we're going to come over here. And use teamwork. We're going to skip your turn. Come over here and we're going to take this guy out. Not the face! Down he goes. Alright, additionally, is any of the enemy down, weak, or hurt in any way? Nope, they're not. Alright, we'll just go over here and punch this guy because we can and because we want to. Wow, we actually did a lot, and then we got counterattacked. But here's the play. We're going to come all the way over... Yeah, all the way over here. Oh, it's still on cooldown. Ooh, I should have probably figured that one out before I did that. That might hurt. We'll see. That was a little bit of a mistake. But again, if the lead survives, it's still fine. Even if all the others go down. Alright. And he did survive, okay. Woo! Alright, the heal Dukin is still out. I'll come over here, I'm going to fire on this guy, hopefully dropping him. With the bow attack, and we did. Do we have the roundhouse thing? We do. Oh, this is going to be good. Square house kick. Let's use that one more time, and we'll eliminate these three. Bam! Get handled. I'm going to come over here, and we're going to use our lightning dagger. And that's going to be sweet, sweet, nice. I'm going to come over here and kick and punch and beat on that guy. Uh, let's see here. Move our lead over here. And I guess we'll use teamwork at this point. How close are we to being able to use the heal duke? And we can't use it yet, right? Yeah. Alright, I'm going to come over here, and hopefully we've got enough oomph to finish off the healer. No, we do not. It's okay. They only have one guy who can attack. Oh, they just got two more. It's okay, though. They still have to close with us, but they never will. And we did it! We survived for all the turns. We defeated eight enemies. And we not only kept the lead standing, but we kept everybody standing. The portal was not found, but tomorrow is a new day. The city hopes Chroma Squad will find it very soon. At least we got some awesome takes. But that plant was hitting for real, Jet. Ouch. Alright, folks. And that's it. 9,000 audience plus 900. And we got all these wonderful materials that were dropped. We'll continue on. Let's see what kind of cash monies we make off of this. Bam. 
3810. Another perfect episode, Chroma Squad, or hashtag Chroma Squad, hashtag Superfan, hashtag Love You Guys. Um, let's see here, hashtag New Season, Chroma Squad, Happy Times, Fight Evil. Finally, season premiere, hashtag yes please. And as I watch, as I was watching Chroma Squad, I burned my meal completely. Yay for me! Alright folks, and our game is being saved, and that is going to do it for this episode. Hopefully you folks had fun. If you did, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and share it. And I will see you guys next time with more Chroma Squad. Until then, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you for stopping by the Freak Show, and I will see you later.